I don't even know the time frame at this point, Glock. Yeah, it's You're hard just to dropping hit after hit, bro. Hard to come out that bad. <laughs> I'm proud of you, man, and, sure. I, and I double salute you. This is how I know you done got into a whole nother bag. You know, I be on Instagram and I fuck with the cars, bro. Mm -hmm. And then it's like, I got these old white dudes who be fucking with, you know, building shit for me. And they was like, man, <laughs> we were listening to some key Glock in your car, <laughs> man. I yeah. love that shit now. Straight up. You're crossing <laughs> over, man. How's it feel? Nah, it's no, it's no but love. I, I appreciate it all. I appreciate yeah. it all. I be seeing it. I get it all the time. Yeah. yeah. But it's one thing, like, I see a lot of artists and creatives now, like, transitioning and doing things that they love to do outside of music, like mm -hmm. those fucking with the cars and shit. But do you see, you know, now that you touching the industry, do you see yourself having any other personal passions, like shit that you just personally like that you would want to tap into one day? I got, uh... I got a little something, something up my sleeve with the fashion. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you're about the fashion? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Put that shit on. Like Put it on style. all the time. Would you want to do more like the designing style or like having a line? What part of fashion would you see yourself? I'm doing it all. Whatever whatever bring income. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Look, man, it's... I wanted to ask you if you got to deal with Instagram or what, because you know that's the first, Let's Go is the first song that pop up when you add music on there. That shit, that shit, that shit be like that now. <laughs> shit going on. <laughs> man, what, what's next for you though, man? I see you riding the success of your recent successes. What, what you gonna pivot into next? I just got a, uh, another tour set up. I'm going to Canada this time, next month. That's dope. Yeah, I got a whole Canada tour. Get some of that overseas money, bro. Yeah, that ain't, some that more ain't, what? That ain't the only country you hitting, though. No, I just got back from a Europe tour. How yeah. was that? I ain't gonna lie, they different. But they, they go hard they as hell for the music over there, man. Nah, for real, they really do. They, they shocked me. I ain't even think it was, was gonna be like that. Were you surprised at how other, a whole nother language of people rocking your shit, knowing the words? Nah, for sure. They like, they energy different. Like, they, the way they show love is, like, it's real different. That's what I was going to ask you, man. You just went out here and rocked the stage for a good 20, 30,000 people. And for you to be so chill right now, how do you how you turn it up like that so high and then come right back to just chill and clock after that? Because, like, this shit real. Like, I ain't faking. I'm just being me. Yeah. Like, it's just Glock. Is this your first time at the One Music Fest? Yeah, this was my first one. Yeah. What you think of it so far? I fuck with it. It was smooth. Say it would turn. Yeah. That's what's up. Is there anybody that you really looking forward to seeing hitting the stage this weekend? Like, you like, shit, I want to stick around just to see this person. I ain't even going to lie to you. I don't even know who all on the lineup. Man, you should have been here last night. Straight when up. Janet Jackson was up in here. She had the thugs crying <laughs> out here, bruh. It was some of the most, nah, she ain't had it was it the going most on, beautiful it. shit you ever seen. Cause it's like, so you, you was see, crying? Almost. But it was some titties okay. that popped out. So almost. You know, he, had, he had a thug tear. You know Straight how up. your eyes like, fill up with the water, but, but they don't fall? Don't fall. I yeah. think I know what you're talking about. Man, <laughs> but it's like, I don't care who you are. Straight some up. people are just on another stratosphere. Whether you came here to see Kodak Black or yeah. who or Megan Thee Stallion. Yeah. When when Janet Jackson hit that stage, it's like the whole Atlanta turned around, bro. It's hard though. It was dudes out there like, man, that Michael Jackson little sister. She need them flowers. She just got that effect, yeah. man. Yeah, she need dope. them flowers. And she really had like a whole stage presence set choreography. Like it was a production. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it was dope yeah. to witness and watch. And I heard Tim's gonna be here tonight. Mm -hmm. I'm excited. I want to see Tim. You know the girls. We want to, you know, get on our Afro beats and, yeah. and vibe out. Do you think as a hip hop artist, a lot of people crossing over and doing both? Could you see yourself doing like Afro beats or doing another genre of hip hop? Maybe like feature wise, but like as far as myself, no, nah, I'm gonna stay in my lane. Cause I don't, you know what I'm saying? I'm, okay. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah. Man, I, I don't think, think like some shit up on some Afro you beats. Could. Yeah, I know I would, but I'm gonna leave that for them. Like <laughs> yeah. I said, if it's a feature, yeah, for sure. Send it to me. I'm, I'm, finna, I'm finna eat that shit up. Man, how hard is it to get a Key Glock feature these days? You seem to be extremely busy. It's all about who you know. I ain't gonna lie. This, <laughs> they, and that's with life. Period. It's all about who you know. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Man, it's been super dope back here, just kicking it at the Backwoods Lounge. 
they gave us an opportunity to come and be a part of the culture, man. And they, I know you're one of the younger artists in here. Have you seen anybody backstage or like behind the scenes that kind of just shock you or took you back for a moment? Like, oh shit, I've been fucking with their music. I hopped straight out the truck and ran straight to the stage. Went okay. to the dressing room, came over here and hollered at y'all. Man, don't leave. I'm telling you, it's, <laughs> it's somebody walking around back here that, like, I know you're a music fan. You gonna see him? Oh shit! It's legends all around here, bro. Nah, New, real. old, real young, talk. up and coming. Everybody been around the sure. one music fest, bro. For sure. How do you prepare yourself for a stage a set like that? Like you said, 30,000 people. You gotta keep. It's so many moving parts. Like you said, you hopping off the. You gotta transport here, get here, get in the yeah. wardrobe, do all that. Like, what do you do to get yourself mentally prepared to hit that stage? I just, I just, no matter what, I don't, I don't ever worry. I don't ever worry. Like, I'm real laid back and chill, even in the most treacherous moments. You know what I'm saying? So, this how, this how I just stay calm, ease my mind too. Okay. Yeah. I, I wanted to ask you this, cause, like I said, you, you in the bag right now. It's just amazing. It seems like you can't miss when it come to dropping new songs and new singles, and and like your shit ain't dying out. It's like. Right. What's your process now to to, to do you doing your follow-ups? Because I know it went from you could just, you know, whatever I want to now it's like now you yeah, feeding a hit. big yeah, audience. Man. Yeah. Hit. It's it's really like a flex. I'm just showing like I can do what I want, when I wanna, how I wanna. Like, you know what I'm saying? Cause like then again I'm just keeping, you know what I'm saying, Dolph name alive, like. This, this shit really independent, like, we, yeah. it's really like that. Like, I'm really having my way. Man, it's just, <laughs> it's dope to see you keep that going, bro. And yeah. it's like, to keep that same energy and that same flow, and know that you still got those fans who want to make sure you good. I still, I see them on your page all the time, still yeah. sending you love and condolences and stuff like that, man. It's like Yeah, this shit really keep me going, really, though. You know what I'm saying? It be the fans. Yeah, it be the love, just the support, really, from everybody. It shit just, it shit dry me. Yeah. yeah. Has it set in yet, though, it's like, that you getting this success, that you, you know, like the lifelong dream that you've been chasing as an artist, as a creative, as entertainer? I ain't, I ain't satisfied. Like, it's, it's so much more to be done. Like, they ain't, I ain't seen shit yet. <laughs> Word. Sure. There, are there any artists you feel like, okay, when I get this feature or when I work with this person or producer, like, I know, for me, I made it. It might not be for everybody else, but like I just want to make sure I lock that one in for my own personal like success. Anybody you feel like if I could just get Can, that? Piece I ain't gonna lie, I'm so cocky and self confident. Ain't nobody gonna make me feel like that. Okay. Like just, just, just for real. Yeah. yeah. See, that's that's that feeling you get when that's you get real. in that zone. You like shit, it's me, nigga. It is <laughs> him. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Man, I, I love like your beat selection. Cause you know, I fuck with the old schools heavy, bro. Right. And you got some some good box Chevy, Monte Carlo, uh, drop top <laughs> music, bro. We from down south, bro. <laughs> down south, bro. <laughs> well, we, we gonna get a Christmas album, a Christmas tape or something. Man, you might get a Thanksgiving one, who knows? Word. Word. That's always <laughs> been one thing that you've been consistent on, is like, you drop a nice volume of music, bro. Yeah. What's in the vault? The vault got a vault. <laughs> I, ain't gonna lie. I, got, I got I got more than enough music. Like I can I can stop recording for the rest of this year and don't record none next year and still drop five tapes. I'm talking about solid tapes. I want to ask you this about because you know it's a movement coming out of Memphis right now. It's driven by the music, but. The joking has been going crazy viral with like it's coming back. It's coming back, bro. <laughs> what you think about that? I know you see like you know we from from around like, the area. It's gangster walking, but yeah, the world like, know it is is that. It, this shit just hard. I ain't gonna lie. Like it's it's just all races, all ages. Like just just having fun with this shit. Right, and I know you know like from Memphis, we all know like a nigga that's slightly too old to be gangster walking. <laughs> that was always cold as the gangster walk. Who was the gangster walking nigga from your hood? Cause I feel like every hood or little section got that one nigga that was always cold with that shit. 
Man, it was, it was this nigga named EJ. He stayed in my grandma cove. My grandma had a cove. And his name was EJ. He like he was a part of this little, little group and everything. Like that's all they did. Like he was the first person I seen do it. He was the one of the best persons I seen do it in person too. So, you know what I'm saying? My boy EJ. That's yeah. what's up, man. Yeah. What what else can we expect from Key Glock, man? No, you like I said, you don't sit down the I'm line. I'm saying key dropping. I ain't gonna lie. I'm, my foot on the gas right now. Flip. 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 That's what's up, man. Yeah. Glock, we appreciate you stopping through the backwoods lounge, man. We gotta sure. make sure we get you some of this dope ass merch, one of these hoodies, one Straight of up. these gift bags, or uh one of these uh some. one of these letterman <laughs> jacket, man. You got the fashion line. I might coming. take the rule, who knows? Oh man, we can get you 85 <laughs> South. Don't worry about me. Man, take that. that rug, man. Man, we, <laughs> I'm going to make sure I got your info. I got to make sure Straight I get up. you some of the new shit anyway. Got you. I'd love for you to stop by the studio again gotcha. and follow up next time you in the city. Bet. When flying D and uh, DC and Chico is there, man. Straight and up. let's take it up another notch, man. Much love and success to you. Let's do it. appreciate you stopping through the back. 100, my boy. Much love. 85 you. South yeah. Show, Backwoods Lounge. None other than Key Glock. The lovely, yeah. the beautiful Miss Brie Renee, and we out of here.